Okay, we're okay now. Excuse me for uh, the technical difficulties. Uh, you already did your session or will you be doing your session today? I'm doing my session today. It's uh, at 11.30. So. 11.30. So if people are still here in this venue, they can still come to your session? They can still come to my session, yes. Okay, nice. What is your session about? I no already know it, but for the viewers. Yeah, yeah. Uh, my talk is about .NET Core tools. Yes. Uh, Microsoft has made uh, it easier to create tools uh, that you can install and run with .NET on your machine. Okay, great. And I'm going to demo uh, a bunch of them and uh, hopefully uh, some of them will stick and I think they are, they're pretty cool and they can improve your developer workflow. So, so, so live demos. Yeah. So you're questioning the demo gods. Uh, I am questioning the demo gods, yeah. <laughs> I hope I, my laptop works. <laughs> I hope your laptop works and also for, for people who are here, Wi-Fi. You yeah. don't need too, too much Wi-Fi? I don't wi need Wi-Fi, so oh, I okay, think I'm going to be fine with that. Oh, then you're a lot safer. Yeah. You're a lot safer. Uh, about those tools, is there one favorite tool in the tools yeah, I think uh, the, there's a whole suite of tools that yeah. you can use to diagnose your applications that are running in production. Yeah. Uh, so they have uh, like uh, event counters and uh, like di uh, making a dump of your application that you can analyze to see if there's memory leaks and stuff like that. Nice. I really like those tools and I think they can really help you diagnose issues with your application. Did you already use this for production? Scenario? I haven't used it for a real production scenario, but I think it's uh, and it, they they only released with .NET Core 3.0, which oh, is just. Yeah. That's, last week so that's not that is not that long <laughs> yeah but you tried it out i tried it out yeah. and, uh, and it's working fine so uh yeah great i'm gonna demo that and also for people who didn't do anything with dotnet core i think that your session will be great as well right yeah yeah i'm gonna start with the basics like how do you even get dotnet on your machine and mm -hmm. how do you get started with dotnet like if you're a visual studio developer you already have dotnet installed but if yeah. you're if you're not using visual studio like you're on a mac or something uh you need to install you're on what oh you what i'm on a Mac. Oh, yeah. you're on. <laughs> Sorry, I, did, I thought I didn't hear that correct. But okay, you're on yeah, a Mac. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm on a Mac, so uh, I'm going to do all my demos on the Mac as okay, well. Okay, great. Uh, so I'm using Visual Studio Code and .NET Core installed on my machine. So you install the SDK, and I'm going to show you how that works and some basic commands to get you started. And nice. Then from there, we'll build up and show all these tools. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, I wish you the best of luck with your session today. Thank and you very much. Uh, perhaps you can come back after your session to tell how busy it was, how many people visited did your session? I will definitely do that. Okay, great. Right. Nice talking to you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. <laughs> All right, guys. Bye. Bye.